Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. A mouth-watering game this between two very high-quality sides, a treat for everybody here. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. The action has already started. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Goes for goal! I can't speak highly enough of the keeper after that save. Can't stop thinking about it. Greenwood. Forward pass. Beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Roberto. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Shaw did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Juan Bissaka. Maguire. Shaw. He's got away. And he won't reach that. Hoists it forward. Good evening, wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, 
that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest and I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favour of, of lots of flair, skill and plenty of tricks and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. And already we're underway here. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Of course, Manuel Neuer. He doesn't just dominate his area, Peter. He seems to control the whole of the defensive third. He's excellent at mopping up any balls that make it through that defensive line. And what's more, he can often turn those interceptions into lethal counter-attacks too. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Davis proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. That's been drilled forward. Now it's Lewandowski. Out to the left it goes. Oh, that is lovely footwork. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Morata. Goes for goal! Oh, within an inch or two. Cristiano Ronaldo nearly produced a moment of magic. He knew the strike was pure. Muller goes long. Danilo cuts it out. Pedrado tries to switch the play. And we've reached half time. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. I to review the first <laughs> half. I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. An intriguing half, lacking only in goal. Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. Is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages one of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world two high profile high caliber teams this is a welcome event for all these supporters well under normal circumstances this is a massive matchup and i'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away in my experience if the opposition go at it full tilt then he's gone for it! Goal! Bayern Munich! And Bayern Munich take the lead! What a great finish, but how 
about the touch. It just allowed him to put the ball exactly where he wanted it, and the rest became a formality. Bayern Munich take the lead. He's just gone and reminded us yet again of what a threat he carries. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. It's got through. Gnabry. Pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heavily. Bayern Munich get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition look completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Well, sadly, for those who are exposed to the elements, I'm afraid that the clouds have opened up and it is teeming down here. There are some fans who are going to get very, very wet. Having said which, there are almost no empty seats. It is a terrific turnout under the circumstances. There's nowhere else to go, in truth, if you want to see this much-anticipated game. So, come rain or come shine, we are here and really looking forward to it. Shoots! He's delivered all right! What a start, and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something, given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, high-quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. 
Bruno Fernandes. And here's Martial. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. And that's one way to annoy his teammates. Shaw. Bailly. Bailly plays it forward. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Greenwood provides an outlet. It's out for a goal kick. Juventus are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. And it's Danilo. Rabio. Surely, and the finish! In it goes! Hot knife through butter, they have done it again! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. <laughs> Juventus get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Ramsey floats one over. Gets it back. And here's Morata. Goes for goal! Ramsey, out to the left it goes. Quadrado. And he's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? Juventus ahead 2-0, and they are looking good.